buying tops is a lot less riskier than buying bottoms because with tops it doesn't need to fit perfectly it doesn't matter if a top is you know slightly bigger um, it's still you can usually still make it work the thing with jeans or pants and skirts and whatever is that it does need to fit right so unless you get your size you know right it's not going to fit so I would suggest that if you've never shopped on that store before then only get one bottom to test what size you are and then you'll know in future what size you are and you can choose more bottoms same thing goes with shoes I am in between sizes and I can sometimes be a size 6 I can sometimes be a size 6 and a half so for me I also prefer not to buy shoes online again if I really like something then I'll just buy one rather than buy a bunch of shoes in that one size and then what if that one size doesn't fit you my final tip is that it's very easy to just buy lots and lots when you're shopping online because it's so convenient and you're just you know you're sitting at home or wherever you are it's just so easy to spend a lot so what I would suggest is that you know put all the items you want in the cart so do all that but then at the very end actually go through the items that you've got in your cart and shortlist think about which items you actually want or need and which items you're actually going to get wear out of um, I always find that if I do this I always eliminate you know at least one or two items because I want to know that I'll actually get wear out of what I buy. So that concludes this very, very long video. I hope you found it useful. Also, if you know of any other online stores which you think are great as well and that you would recommend, please comment below. So that